Hey guys, uh, just here gonna teach you how to use sound alerts on Twitch. Uh, first thing you wanna do is go to your Twitch channel, or just to Twitch in general. Go to your top right right here with your profile picture, click on it, go down to creator dashboard. Once here, you will be able to see all the quick actions. If you don't have sound alerts already on this list, this is the plus, and go and search for sound alerts. Once you've clicked Add, click on Sound Alert, go to My Extensions, and now you'll be able to click on Sound Alerts, the title, and click on Configure. Open Sound Alerts Dashboard. It'll open up a new tab. It'll log into your Twitch for you. And there's videos here already for this, but I'll just explain it now. It's not too hard. I'm going to be using OBS. You can click on I use something else if you don't. But how you make this work is... You click on I use OBS, and then you go to the scene you want to have this in, click and drag and drop, like so, and just drop right there. It'll say, hey, we've noticed you're trying to drag a URL, click yes, and it'll make a sound alert right there. I already have it in my gaming channel, but that doesn't have display capture, so I can't show you it. Anyway, next thing you go to is, here, we're going to move this back out, we're going to go to library. And this is where all your sound alerts are. You can actually upload your own here, it looks like. And you can pick favorites and create sound, which is also uploading them. But there's a bunch of pre-made ones, which is quite good, actually. And his name is John C. That's really loud. You have to be careful with that. It might be good to just turn your volume down when you're on this website. Uh, you can test which ones, uh, the ones you want to hear with these buttons right here and you click to add this sound so let's go to sad and bonk and you click on add you can pick either extension which will be bits or channel points and I'll show you how to change that and set that up you go to settings scroll all the way down channel points let viewers play sound alerts with their channel points enable that and now when you're back here and you find one you like Click to add the sound, and then you can go over to channel points and set up your channel points. So, say we want not 411, I want 100. You can rename it, click add sound. And now it's going to be in your sounds here. This is extension, so this would be bits, and you click over on channel points. And now you have, I've already set up three of them, but now you have this one, right? And now you can play the sound alert either on this page or on your um, OBS, which does work. You can change the volume whatever you like. I'm going to change them all down to 50% because I don't want it to be too loud. And hopefully that works. I'm not, I haven't actually heard a difference yet. Uh, it should be changing it down. And you hit save. You can change the cooldown how many people can use it in a row. So you'll get the sound effect and it will, it'll wait 5-10 seconds and you get the sound effect again. And boom! Now the best part is that it's already here. So if you go to your bits, I mean sorry, your uh, channel points, it's already here. You have Baba Booey, if the King Boo, we have all of them already. It automatically puts them into your channel point, which is very nice. So you don't actually have to set anything up. You can change these where you change your channel points, of course. You change colors, looks, everything. And that's about it for sound alerts. I just figured this out just now, and I'm pretty happy with how easy it is. So, you know, just go and find your alerts. Oh, sorry. Actually, I'm back. I lied. Um, right here, overlay alert. This is easy. This is uh, where you can pick... If you want something on screen, or if you don't want anything on screen. And personally, I don't want anything on screen, I just want the sound alert. And so, I changed it to that. And have fun with it. Adios, guys.